Okay, so this is an idea I just came up with. Uh, it's for measuring the level of water within a reservoir. Now, I have three leads going into it. Two are there to determine the uh, resistance of the water, and then the final one is to determine the depth of the water. So, if you take a look at this here, there are two at the bottom with a set distance, and then there's one running up along the side here with exposed copper all the way up to the top. So, if we look at these meters here, this is the two that are at the bottom with a known distance, and that this is the one that will tell you the depth. So I'm gonna add some more salt water here. I just found salt water was more stable than tap water. So let me just add some more water here. So that's approximately halfway full. And I'll let that stabilize. Okay, now the meters seem to be showing the proper resistance. Now it did take about 15 minutes for the water and resistance values to stabilize to a point that I could actually use. Now that could be uh, due to the salt in the water settling to the bottom or just stabilizing within the liquid. There may be some electrolysis going on. I don't think so since uh, ohm meters don't put out much voltage at all, but that could be a factor. So it does seem to work okay. I haven't done the calculations for depth and whatnot, but I'll show you a comparison of what the resistances are now compared to what they were when the cup had barely any water in it at all. So you'll be able to see how it appears. All right, thanks for watching, and maybe someone else who knows a little more about chemistry or electronics can improve on this idea. Thanks for watching.